Hey there guys, this is Kevin at Lakeside Buggies and today I wanted to bring you a video on the Vibe EV EV4 forward facing four passenger cart. I want to go over all the features on this cart with you today. Um, show you a little clip here in a second of this cart driving down the road. Um, I did record a lot of this video in the wrong aspect ratio and I apologize for that. I'm going to post this video today anyways because I just don't know when I'll have a chance to reshoot the video in the correct aspect ratio. Um, so please bear with me and I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's go for a ride. Got the 2024 Vibe EV, 14 inch wheels, 23 inch off road tires, body matched paint to the roof. You've also got body matched stitching on the seats. Really nice stitched in Vibe logo here in the seats. High quality marine grade vinyl. These should last for a while. They're very nice seats, very comfortable. And yeah, they're as comfortable as they do look there. The Vibe EV is going to come with a fleet lithium. 105 amp hour, 51 volt battery, specifically designed for this golf cart. That's a great battery with a five year warranty. Lots of seating room for the passengers in the rear. We'll be adding a cup holder there for you know your drinks in the back. You've got four cup holders here in the front. Very large storage pockets, something that's been asked for a lot, something you can lock, something you can store in. This front seat is empty inside and it will allow you to store in underneath. Uh, carbon fiber steering wheel. Glass windshield. Glass windshield with an automatic windshield wiper. Super smooth windshield wiper. Killer front end. Unlike anything else we've ever seen here before. Projector style LED headlights. You've got high beams, low beams. This is going to be your low beam on currently. This is, I'm sorry, this is going to be, yeah, your low beam, then your high beam. And I'll show you that. Let's turn this windshield wiper off. So now we've got that high beam on. Extraordinarily bright, but also directed at the road. These headlights are uh, definitely just leaps and bounds better than some of the headlights we've seen on a lot of these cars where you can't see the road and we're adding light bars and accessories and things like that. Four wheel disc brakes, of course, hydraulic disc brakes, McPherson style struts. So you have a really nice automotive grade suspension on this. These things ride like a dream. You've also got disc brakes in the rear as well as coilovers in the rear. So they're adjustable height coilovers. You can actually raise and lower your suspension back here in the back just a little. I think you've got about three inches of movement there. Accessories will be available as well. So on this particular cart, we've got that front basket installed. We've also got the side steps installed and we will have an entire back seat kit and of course a six passenger roof available, but we will not be uh, bringing in a regular four passenger. So it'll always be a forward facing four or a six. Creature comforts inside don't lack either. Jump inside. You've got this huge 11 inch digital dash. This is going to be your home screen that shows your uh, power for the battery. That's CAN bus direct to the battery. So that is reading the computer inside of your lithium battery, letting you know exactly where you're at. And then your speedometer here. <coughs> Down here, you show your voltage. And then up here, you're going to see your amperage that the battery's putting out. All good information for different reasons at various times. And then down here, you have your headlight switch. Your dash will actually automatically illuminate and brighten and dim. It's hard to see here, but it does. Forward and reverse switch here. Hazard light here. LED turn signals in your mirrors. <clears throat> but here's the cool thing about our dash. So you can see there's no wires here. And yes, that is Apple CarPlay. Uh, it's also very smooth. It runs very fast, even though my battery on my phone is almost dead. So wireless Apple CarPlay, no wires required. You Bluetooth in. When you first get your cart, you're gonna connect to Bluetooth 
and a few minutes, a few seconds later, you're going to see uh, this phone works with CarPlay. Do you want to accept that? You're going to hit yes on your phone, and then yes on the screen, and then you will wirelessly 100% connect to Apple CarPlay. Uh, a lot of the times, these radios have a really short range, so if you walk five feet away, you're going to start to lose the signal. <clears throat> this has a really strong Wi-Fi signal on it. Apple CarPlay uses Wi-Fi directly uh, instead of Bluetooth to operate, and we upped the antenna kind of reception, I guess you could say, on this to where you'd be able to get in and out of the golf cart. You can walk about 100 feet away from this, and there is no interruption in your music or sound. <clears throat> Great for if you're on the golf course playing golf. Of course, you don't want to leave your phone in the cart, maybe in the glove box or, you know, just leaving it, uh, you know, here on the dash or whatever. You want to leave that in your pocket so you can quickly respond to your clients that you're avoiding while you're playing golf. You will not lose reception. You won't lose audio. You will just keep going just like normal. Get out, take your swing, come right back to the cart path, get back on your cart and take off. Very cool feature. Um, so we did design this with golfers in mind. Stereo audio is very good. There are two factory installed speakers on this version now, uh, but we are probably going to upgrade that with four. So you'll have two more underneath the front seat. And then you've got a really nice built-in equalizer here. Oops, sorry. Well, actually, that was a good feature to show there. So your home button takes you between your speedometer and your power gauge. Uh, back and forth between your uh, wireless Apple CarPlay or your wireless Android Auto. To go to your settings screen, you'll tap your home button right there. Go into your settings here. Now you can get into your equalizer. Uh, you can make the volume. <clears throat> Obviously, when you have the four speakers, you can fade and balance. The loud setting is kind of cool if you like the bass. Uh, and then you can jump into this actual digital equalizer here. A very simple process here on the screen, nothing really to break, nothing to get in here, change settings on, and, uh, you know, ruin your radio. You can change your wallpapers on the background here. You got some futuristic little looks. Anyhow, you can change your time. And then general settings down here, you can change certain settings like your backup camera, the uh, volume of your radio when you go into your reverse mode. Uh, for example, that beeping sound there. Oh, and there's the backup camera as well. It's very clear. Um, but you can change some settings up here on the dash in, relate, in relation to your rear reverse camera, which is something that I've never seen on a cart before. Brightness. Uh, you can change even the LED colors here. Super cool. Super, super cool. This dash, it was really important that it was going to operate well. Um, there's nothing worse than having something cool on a cart that doesn't work. So we didn't waste our time with the uh, lower quality dashes. We found the highest quality dash we could get in here. And you're looking at that now. <clears throat> but also very simple. Uh, nothing, nothing really to go wrong. So anyways, guys, this is going to be available in 2024 at Lakeside Buggies. You'll find them on our website in eight different colors. You're going to have this nice blue. You'll have a purple and a white. Well, I can actually, I can take you back over here and show you a couple of the other colors. There we go. The Arctic white is bright, bright pearl white. There's no off whites. It's not Cadillac white. That is white as you can get with a metallic pearl in that paint. Then you've got our metallic silver. Silver is silver, very common, very popular color. The bright orange, really awesome purple. And then I don't have it here to show you right now. It is a very light, excuse me, a very bright sublime green. And that's a heavy uh, pearl lime green color that I'm really excited about. As a matter of fact, I've got a chassis here I can show you too. So with this golf cart, there's really nothing to hide. You've got a nice 30 amp voltage reducer here. You've got your controller mounted right here. Programming port here. These come pre-installed with a fleet lithium battery charger from the factory right there. <clears throat> Serial number, of course, here, and then there'll be another on the front frame. Here's your coilovers on the rear, as well as a good glimpse at your rear disc brakes. Very, very large rotors, very nice braking system on this cart. Huge five kilowatt motor here on your automatic parking brake. Very nice quality 
frame. Uh, the welds are very well done. Well, I won't take all that out, but your battery tray is also going to be a solid battery tray. You don't see straight down to the ground, which is fantastic, so you don't have a lot of dirt and dust just blowing up into your battery tray, and I can show you that on the blue one over there that we have already built. And on the front end, as I was saying, you have the McPherson struts, which is a very nice automotive grade style strut, top bearing. So when you're turning, it's light, smooth turning. Very nice, high quality uh, automotive style disc brakes. And they're much larger disc brakes than what I've seen on other cars before. <clears throat> Alrighty. So back over here, guys. After our little uh, detour and our air compressor just kicked on. I'm sorry about that. But uh, last quick view at the Vibe EV here. This is the 2024 Vibe EV4, currently available only at Lakeside Buggies. And that may change throughout the next year as we talk to new dealers and uh, you know, get this program up and running. But we're excited. Can't wait to get these colors all built out, get some really cool social media content, and uh, really start to show this part off. And hear from you guys about your opinions on the cart. And if you have any questions, please feel free to let me know in the comments.